everyone. Happy onesie Wednesday. I'm going to get Lucas changed for you and I wanted to show you the onesie that he'll be wearing today. It says all you need is love and I'm a huge Beatles fan and I just couldn't leave Target without getting this. Um, as you guys seen in the video before this one, I went to Target and showed you a little bit what they had. And they did have a lot of cute outfits out for spring and summer already. But I am trying to behave myself until the new babies come home. So I only picked this up for Lucas. And I picked up my very first Wubbana. This is my very first one. And I know these are kind of pricey, but I thought, you know what, I've been so good <clears throat> of watching what I spend. And I thought I wanted to get something cute for the new baby coming home. And of course, Lucas can borrow this too. So um, I just I just had to get it. And I know that there are different animals in the Wubba Nubs, but I really love the giraffe. I also like the frog. I think the frog was really cute. So, yeah. Oh, here are the little characters. There's a puppy, a frog, a bear, uh, a fox. I believe that's a fox. I really want the fox one. And I want the frog and the puppy. I think those are the only ones I want. But I didn't see them all there, so I'm sure I can probably go on Target online and, and collect the other ones. But they're just so tiny. They're just so tiny. So I'll open that for you guys after I get him changed. So he's going to wear that onesie I showed you with some sneakers. So we're going to take these little shoes off of him right now. It's been raining all day today, off and on, which is great. You know, I love the rain and we could definitely always use the rain here in the desert. I probably should have left his socks on because he's just going to wear the same pair. Oh well. See, these shorts were like, they look like little bloomers to me because they're like bubble shorts to me because they're like puffy. They're just cute. I think they're cute. We had a wonderful day yesterday celebrating Aubrey's birthday and my other niece, Mariah. I forgot to mention that in the video yesterday. Mariah is my brother's little girl and she was born the same day and the same hospital as Aubrey. Aubrey came two weeks early. Aubrey was supposed to be born in March but she was ready in February. <laughs> so it's so cool that they do have the same birthday and that they were born at the same hospital. Um, not at the same time. They were born a few hours from each other, but what a great story for them to share as cousins. You know, they're gonna always have that special day so we do things separately so the girls don't feel like, you know, that they have to share birthdays. So Brie had her party and Mariah had her party and they each had their own cake, you know, because we don't want to rain on each other's parade and make them blend them together, even though they were born on the same day. But they are just so adorable and so cute, those two. Aubrey was just so excited um, to get all her troll stuff. So that was really cute to see. She just loves the movie Trolls. If you guys haven't seen it yet, I believe it's out on DVD now. I did see it at Target. I think, I think anyone would like that movie. I, I don't. I just love the singing in there. The singing was great. It had a wonderful message. It was really done well. Wow, is this going to be snug on you? It looked big. Or 
or maybe it's just going to fit you just right. I don't know. You guys can see them? Okay. Oh, that is blue. Looks so cute on him. It's about 68 outside. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful weather. Okay, we're going to put his little white socks back on. I'm in love with these socks that Angela sent me. <laughs> they just fit the baby's feet so good. I've never had socks. Well, I shouldn't say I never. I think I have one or two other pair that fit this good. And I love them. And she told me that they are from Granimals. Granimals makes these socks. And they are a brand that's sold at Walmart. Okay, so he's going to wear these little blue suede shoes. <laughs> these are so cute. These are by Baby Gap. And they have red, um, oops, red material on the inside and this blue suede on the outside. They are just the cutest. And these I bought from... Amanda. Callum, I don't even think. No, Callum didn't even wear these because they had the tags on them still. And I thought these sneakers would look so cute with this onesie here. You know what? I didn't even see what size these are. Zero to three months, that's what size these are. And they fit his foot really good as you can see oh okay. and it's like a darker blue suede with a little bit I would say dark blue and navy blue. Oh. They did have two versions of this, but the second version of the Beatles was too big. And I I think it said this I think it said the same message. All you need is love. So, um I want to say it was darker. Gosh, my memory I was just so happy that this was zero to three, so it was like I just grabbed it. <laughs> I gotta open this one up a little bit because this is his dance foot. This is what I call his dance foot. It reminds me of like a ballerina or something. Oh, and I think Amanda had said one time um, when she was dressing Callum, I think she had said, you know those ladies that dance in the water? Oh, what are they called? And they do their little kicks in the water. <laughs> yeah. That reminds me of that too. So they have a arch, so you kind of have to like push their foot in there gently. And sometimes it will go all the way to the bottom. Or sometimes it might stop like right here, you know, it just depends on the shoe. But these fit him really good. Wow. Baby Gap is like one of my all time favorite brands. Oh, look at that. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> you cutie patootie. Oh, this little boy. Such a little stinker. He's so cute. Alrighty. We gotta hang up or put the clothes away. I just took off him. Look at those scratch mitts. Alright, let's open this wubba nub. Hmm. 
<laughs> it says the original and award-winning pacifier that soothes the whole family. This is so cute. And you know what? The giraffe is so soft. It almost feels like a jelly cat. That is so adorable. I don't know if I'm going to modify it or not. I want to. I really, really want to. I mean, because it's like super adorable. But at the same time, I'm like, oh, I don't want to modify it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's your little love and love. Am I going to have to get you one? Am I going to have to get you one and your brother one? Oh, it's so cute. Now I can see why everybody likes these. They are adorable. Oh, that is really cute. I'm glad I got the giraffe. The giraffe is just so precious. I love giraffes, by the way. Um, so yeah, that was cute. I don't know if they have a little lamb one. Now, I did see on Instagram, I think Amy from Vintage Bond Nursery got the deer one. Oh my gosh, that was like... <gasps> So adorable. I really want that for my new baby girl that's coming. Oh, I seen that. I was like, oh my gosh, it's so cute. All right, everyone. I think that's about it. I hope everyone has a great Wednesday. Let me take you off the camera or the tripod. Let's zoom you out a little bit. Okay, there he is. Hi, baby. I can say hi to your aunties. Let's see the, the little shirt here. Or onesie, I should say. There you go. See, so, yeah, like Kat says, the lyrics by Lennon and McCartney. And then here are the little shoes up close. Blue suede shoes. Makes me think of Elvis. So cute, sweetheart. All right. You guys have a wonderful day. And then theme Thursday is tomorrow. Um, do you guys know what themes are for Friday and Saturday and Sunday? Do we have themes? I can't remember if we have themes for those days. I know Monday is Disney Monday. Tuesday is T-shirt and diaper day. Wednesday, onesie Wednesday, Thursday theme, Thursday that Amy comes up with, but I wasn't sure what was Friday or Saturday or Sunday. Um, let me know in the comments below uh, what those are, if we have any. All right. Take care, everyone. Bye.